I feel like this is appropriate for today's day because we appreciate women of all sorts of nature and all sorts of backgrounds and all sorts of, you know what I'm saying, type shit. Um, type stuff, my bad. Um, you know, and as a professional, professional, professional connoisseur as myself, I feel like it would be behooved of me to deprive y'all, you know what I'm saying, of this video. You feel me? Now, the only person that probably wouldn't like this video is AO because obviously, you know, he loves men, of course, and uh, he doesn't appreciate women in all of their beauty. So, uh, A, I would appreciate it if you don't say anything on this topic because, you know, we don't need you to disrespect any women, especially black women that will be on here on this on this instant. Shut up. I'm just being honest. You know what I mean? But I'm just I'm just disrespectfully, you know, what I mean, just for this one to sit out for this one. You know, what I mean, young sir, because, uh, you know, you know what I mean? Like, I will I would not like no disrespect, no misogyny, no misogyny coming out of you while we, you know, watch this video because, you know, you got we got to be 100 percent wholesome. I will slap the fuck out of you. Why would you say that to an innocent woman that's that's on the screen? Like she literally has she's doing nothing to you. Like, why would you say that to this woman, bro? That's crazy, man. You can't never trust Ayo with anything, bro. We brought together seven women with natural butts. I will be the judge of that. Six natural butts versus one secret BBL. Real butt. <laughs> I have a real butt. I can't really tell because of the pants, but I'm gonna say this is real. Yeah, this is real. I have a real butt. I have, I have a real butt. <laughs> I have a real butt. I have a real butt. Yeah, that's definitely her booty. But I have a real butt. That's definitely her. I have a real butt. You might be suspect number one, ma'am. You might be suspect number one you might be suspect hear me out the reason why i say she's suspect number one is that thing a little too pokey back there you know what i'm saying that thing a little too pokey back there like it's like a little too pokey she looks mad beautiful you only saying that because you see her assets on the screen but what about her what about the what about her what about her soul though? Like what about what about else what else is screaming to you about her being attractive? Is it that she can that she's a very uh smart woman? Is it that she brings more value than her body? You know what I'm saying? Like you know what I mean? Why why we must evaluate the assets instead of evaluating the soul? You know what I'm saying? Like you know what I mean? Why are we looking, you know what I'm saying? Her glasses, okay? Okay. She looks very fit and self understandable. Okay. But I have a real butt. What about what about this woman? What's screaming to you on this woman right here? What's screaming to you on this woman right here? But I have a real butt. I mean, I can't tell you have a skirt on. I couldn't even tell for the last two because her jacket's covering her ass, so she might be real and she got a skirt on, so I don't know. But all right, she's definitely suspect number one. She might be suspect number two. She might be suspect number two. <laughs> Gee willikers, good golly grease. <laughs> I think for sure these two got real asses. Well, I can't really tell with her because she has a skirt on, so I can't really tell. This is definitely her ass for sure, 100%. Yes, it's looking like her ass too. Well, she black, so you know, ain't, you know, two black women ain't ain't least likely that they got BBLs. Let's keep it plus. Plus, I could tell that she got she got she got she got a lot of ankle support back there, so you definitely know that's her ass. Plus, she got high heels, so it does lift the booty up a little bit, so it make it it does make it a little perched out there. But I'm guarantee you, you know, I mean, with the ankle support, I could tell by the ankle support to her legs that that's definitely her booty. This is definitely her booty, most likely hers. These two are suspects. 
these two are suspects. Now that I think about it, she might be more of a suspect, for real, for real. Because the sundress might be throwing it off. Sometimes the sundress be a little bit too tight. And it, 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 it protrudes the booty to be as big as it is. So maybe, maybe, maybe it's not a BBL, but it might be a little bit false advertising. And she, I can't really tell, because she A, got platformers on, and B, she got a skirt. So it's kind of hard to really tell the thigh to ratio. See, as a, as, a, as a professional booty detective as myself, it's all about the thigh to ratio. The ankle to thigh to ass ratio. If her ankles and her thighs are smaller than her ass, she has a BBL. If it don't look natural, if it looks like the letter P, you know that is fake with a P. You know what I'm saying? But if it if it looked like if it looked like a piece of chicken, church's chicken with the extra gristle. Extra crunch. And you become a munch. You know what I'm saying? Works out and what do you do? I work Dick out. Is amazing. Like, I can show y'all I can okay. work out. Like, <laughs> okay. So I'm like, I am a personal trainer. That's why she wore the jacket. Yeah, that's a real ass. That's a, I thought she was just thick. Nah, she She muscular. That's a muscular. That's a god booty. I'm sorry. That's a god level booty. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know how the hell she muscular, but with a with a very big butt. I don't understand. She doing some voodoo. It's the blackness in her. She got it. You know what I'm saying? Type okay, shit. But like, I do work out. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. Okay. Homegrown. Yeah. No, I lost um, 50 pounds. I was a bigger girl, so that's just something I've. Okay, that makes more sense now. That makes more sense. Uh, experience of people do a lot of bulgarian squats oh yeah oh, my God. Oh. Uh, what's a bulgarian what what did you just make up that i never heard that exercise oh my God, those oh, kill me. Well, i just started working out again so i used to almost be 300 pounds so i started losing a lot of weight oh my God. so i've been all right never mind it, it was the angle it was the angle okay never mind it was just the it was just the camera. It's, it's probably with how she put her leg never mind never mind i take it back i take it back i take it, i take it back i take it back because not that Nah, wait a second. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Wait a second. She might have the BBL. Hear me out. Look at how her legs are. And then look at the circumference of the pokage of the tail end of the ass. Something ain't right. But if everybody knows science and math, skirt a skirt is held down by gravity. Therefore, it will shape your ass in some way, shape, or form from the top of your at the top of the back to the ass part. This seems like a little too far out from where her from where her thighs are. Uh, she might have a BBL. Here's a great example, right? The letter P. If you know physics, you know. When you put when you put a piece of cloth on something, right? When you put a piece of cloth on something, it's held down by gravity, right? Gravity, gravitational pull. You know this. You just studied this. You was just in, you would you just you was you was in school. You, you I mean you're still in school. You know what I mean? You only you know what I'm saying? You, you know what I mean? Type shit. You know what I mean? So gravity. It's hold down, right? Newton's law, right? Type shit. You know what I mean? When a piece of cloth covers an object, right? The density of that cloth takes shape of that object. So, for example, right? You see how this woman's clothes fit to her, and it, you can see the circumference of the, you know, the booty, it's right type shit, right? Since this is a skirt and it's not enclosed, you can tell where the ass is from her back type shit. So therefore, the cloth is hanging off of her ass. So therefore, that means her ass would be right here. And this is where the cloth would be hanging off of type shit. But that doesn't make sense, though, because if you if you if you draw a line from her ankle. To her, to her, to her, to her, where her ass should, should technically be, her ass should be right here. 
not right here. That means there's a couple inches back there. And that probably means that she, that's a couple inches that she doesn't necessarily own. Or was moved. Or the real estate was moved from one property to another, if you catch my drift. You know what I'm saying? Girl. I probably made zero sense. But it made sense in my head. But you know what I mean? Y'all get it, though. Wow. You're built so different. Thank you. Okay. All right, yeah. See that? That's, that looks makes that makes more sense. I would be surprised if that is a BBL. But she works out. Well, people with BBLs do still work out, though. So I might have to, I might have to go back into my exam to get my uh, ass detector, like, license, you know, updated. Because, you know, I've been out the game for a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 It was still jiggling even after she after she stopped moving. God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I don't want to. Oh no no no, that's good. That's okay. What the fuck is this? It is Pat. What if you don't get your ass in there? Whoa. You know what I'm saying? I'm Spanish and Mexican, so my dad and my mom's family. They're all pretty much like that. Yeah. <laughs> so I feel like it does play a big part. And my dad is actually the one that I get my butt genetics from. So when I work out, obviously glutes are important, mm -hmm. but it, I don't have to work as hard just because I have that genetics. Your mama don't got an ass? I wonder if I have kids that, that my kids gonna have my ass genes. I hope not. I hope not. <laughs> I hope not, bro. I hope not, bro. I don't... I don't want my kids running around with BBLs. Wait, that sounds crazy. There. Yeah, I get you. I always had kind of like a little bit of a big butt, but like it definitely was nowhere near like how it is now. Okay. Yeah, like I'm very transparent with that on, well, you guys don't have me on Instagram, but like with my clients, that's Digga, what I promote. Look, you like, know what I mean, bro? Butt, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm all for You know what I mean? Dominant gene, recessive gene. You know what I'm saying? As a male, males have dominant genes. You know what I mean? And you know, the ass, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, my wife also has a as an ass, you know what I'm saying? I guess that's two, that's a dominant recessive gene. So if we crossbreed the genes together, it's most likely my kids will have fat asses. Like, I, what else? What else? What else am I supposed to say, bro? It's scientific. It's scientifically proven. I'm not saying that. I want, you know what? I'm gonna be quiet, bro. It's all okay, on the red, bro. That's fair. <laughs> Just okay. a warning. I ain't got no rhythm. No, no, no. You have no. <laughs> <like> <laughs> Okay, I'll go first. What are we doing? I don't know. What do you guys want to join? Just, Just like, yeah. do it? <laughs> okay, I'll go first. Okay. I don't know. What do you guys want to join? Just, Just like, yeah. do it? <laughs> she got the BBL. You had a real booty. You know how to shake the ass. Right. <laughs> I don't know what you guys want to do. I was not expecting yeah, that. That was great. That was awesome. I'm just gonna move it. <laughs> oh, well, you're wearing tights though. Cause yeah. I was not expecting that. Yeah, that was great. That was awesome. I'm just gonna move it. Oh, well, you're wearing. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's hard. You know, just got to examine just one more time. You know what I mean? Just one more time. Got to examine one more time. <laughs> just one more time. Just got to examine one more time. Yeah. 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 It's hard. Yep, that's real. It is hard. I feel like when I walk, like it just it moves. Yeah. So like, I don't know, like okay. something like that. <laughs> something like that. I, I have no. <laughs> it's so much like that. And it's still jig too. God damn. <laughs> just. <I don't> know. <laughs> She's Asian, so I don't want to hear she Asian, so I don't care. I don't care. I know, I know plenty of Asian women that know how to throw it back. I've, I've seen it firsthand. I witness it. This is not an excuse. It is not an excuse. This is not an excuse. Still fine though, Rebecca. We gotta work on this, girl. Honey, baby, we gotta work on this. We gotta work on this, bro. They may not know how to shake their ass, but you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, they know at least they know the mo the movement. You know what I'm saying? 
You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? It's all about the movement. You know what I'm saying? When a nigga get up, you know what I'm saying, type shit. I ain't about to do it, though. But you know what I'm saying? I could if I want to. I'm not, I'm not going to thug shake, but you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? I ain't about to do it, bro. I ain't real easy. Look, you know what I'm saying? But, like, you know what I mean? Like, come on. How come more guys know how to throw it back than women? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Every, the best ass shakers are bro. Like, that's crazy. That's, fact, that's, that's crazy that I can literally, I can literally twerk better than y'all. Hell, my ass probably fatter than y'all too. Shit, y'all's with you. No BBL, all hard work. I don't know. I'm wearing so a skirt, so you are. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. Boo! Boo! <laughs> Boo! <laughs> this is wow, 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 wow. Get her out of here just because. I don't even care if she has a BBL. Just get her out, bro. <laughs> Just get her out. Joy's <laughs> outfit. It was yes. Today, Today yeah. Yes. It's yeah, so yes. boom everywhere on my freaking Instagram. Everywhere I like, drive down the road. Like I feel like it's just in your face. Kim K, Kylie Jenner. In the black community, like ass is just like always just been a thing. Because, oh, definitely. Like, gen Not just in the black community, in the lat Latino community as well. It's just that's just I think that's just a people of color thing, personally. Let's just keep it a buck. Like, you know, that's just not a black person thing. That's a, that's a people of color thing. For some reason, pe as people of color, we just love the finer things in life, including big ass. You know what I'm saying? That's just, it's, it's, just in, it's just ingrained in all of our cultures together. Like, literally, if you go back in the history of time, you know what I'm saying? Like, the Macedonia, uh, what's that shit called? <laughs> Mesopotamia? <laughs> Mesopotamia, <laughs> Mesopotamia, like you know what I'm saying, like you know what I mean. The, before the Ottoman Empire, like you know what I'm saying, like you know what I mean, like before before the dawn of time, when man was first discovered, you know what I'm saying, like before Cleopatra and you know what I'm saying all that type of shit. Before the Dino Dino like Stone Age, you know what I'm saying when it was amiibos, you know not amiibos. <laughs> Amoebas, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Ass has been in our DNA. There has at least been one, one single-celled organism that had a fat booty. I guarantee you there was a, there was, before we had multicellular, multicellular, you know what I'm saying? Like, organisms. We had single-celled organisms that roamed the earth, that lived in negative 20,000 degree, you know what I'm saying, climate. I guarantee you one of them single cells had a big booty. And another single cell organism was like, yeah, I need that. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's been there since the dawn of time. There's this booty everywhere, bro. It's just a part of our, it's a part of human nature, bro. It's a part of human nature. I'm not waffling, bro. It's true. Every organism has a species of, of an animal, of uh, a species of, of, of an organism that has a big booty. There's a big booty butterfly, obviously big bo booty human, obviously. Chimpanzees, monkeys, obviously. Apes, gorillas, there's definitely BBLs in that community as well. Giraffes, uh, iguanas, uh, you know, lizards. Li yes, there, there's probably a lizard out there that has a big ass. Crocodiles, big ass. They're probably a big, a big ass, you know what I'm saying? Crocodiles got a big ass, you know what I'm saying? Um, birds. You know what I'm saying? Um, bugs. There's probably multiple ants that have big booties out there. Like, there's probably a big booty ant out there. There's probably an ant out there that got a big ass butt. And you know what I'm saying? Another ant probably trying to hit that. You know what I'm saying? Big booty flowers. Big booty leaves. In the plant world, there's probably one plant out there that got a big ass. Big booty. We just love booty, bro. It is it's just it's a part of human nature. It's a part of human, it's not it's a part of org, our organism's DNA that we all share in every tree, every every walk of life. The ass is just there. You know what I'm saying? Why do you think lions attack gazelles from their ass? Because lions like asses, bro. 
and the ass is the best part of the body. <laughs> oh my god, Drew, but I'll just read it. I she pissing me off just looking at her, bro. All right, if the box turns green, you guys have successfully voted the mole out, and you all get to split Somebody the fart? prize. If the box turns red, that means you guys have lost, and the mole has won. Are you ready? No. I know. Let it be green, please. Oh my gosh! Yes. Thank you, Dora. Good job. Good job. Teamwork. Amazing. 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 On the count of three, the mole can reveal themselves. Okay. You guys ready? Yes. One, two, three. Oh. Sometimes I wish I wasn't, I wasn't, like, you know. Her shit wasn't moving or nothing. Fake Latina. Now, to be fair, she do got jeans on, so you can't really tell. So I just assumed that it was, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, she might just be, it just might be the restriction of the pants. You, you feel me? But then I was, like, I don't know, man. Like, even if she do have a BBL, it don't even look like she got anything done for real. Because it's like, it didn't do much for you, girl. It didn't do much for you. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't know what you was trying to accomplish, but it did not do much for you. I, oh, I, knew it. <laughs> Sorry. I actually got a BBL when I was 17. About to say, ask her for a nice dinner or going for some kind of body positivity. No, that, <laughs> that's really controversial for me to say, but I just feel like social media makes it seem like you have to have like an hourglass. Oh, she had a BBL. Oh, so she doesn't have one anymore. She had one. Okay. Had, uh, bigger. You have to have a big butt. I chose to get a BBL okay. because I was really um, self-conscious about the way that I looked. And I just genuinely felt like having a BBL, it would just improve my quality of life. You don't need to do that. That's the crazy thing, bro. Like, do that. Cause no niggas, if you trying to get a nigga off of that, that's not gonna work, girl. I'm sorry. Cause that nigga only gonna see you for as an object. And he's gonna be like, bro, what the fuck is this? You know what I'm saying? Cause if we know we ain't get a BBL for yourself, you know it, it, it was most likely for niggas. You know what I'm saying? See, this is why this why there's a problem. The internet is a problem, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. No shit. The internet is a big problem because you know people look at the internet and see all these other people and try to like mimic that so they think that it can, that it's gonna work for them. It's like, bro, you can't do that, bro. Like, you know, you know what I'm saying? You gotta be yourself, man. Like, don't worry about what other niggas is doing. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry about these women out here that getting these BBLs and shit. It's all for performative art, bro. They're not. They only doing it for a bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? And you got real people out here ruining their lives because they want to get likes on Instagram. And internet is really ass, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. The internet is ass. Don't believe these niggas, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, just be, man. Don't worry about it. Don't get a BBL. You know what I'm saying? Like, just go to the gym and work out. And if you don't, if you don't want a fat ass, you don't need a fat ass, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? I don't know how else to say. Like, you don't need, you don't need to look a certain way. There's gonna be somebody out there that gonna be for you. You should do it because you want to improve on yourself, not for, not to improve yourself for other niggas, but to improve yourself for yourself. You know what I mean, that's real. That's real talk. All right, that was a, that was a cool video though. I like that, bro. I love looking at booty. You know what I mean? Cause I'm a bootyologist. I'm the booty connoisseur. I'm the booty captain. I'm the booty man. The booty warrior. The warrior of the booty. I love butts.